Nina, thank you so much for joining us. I'm Monica Garcia, Arizona's Republican Attorney General is going after the city of Tucson. Mark Brnovich filed a civil rights lawsuit against the city today, saying it discriminated against city employees who refused to comply with City Hall's vaccine mandate. News for Tucson's Eric Fink is live at City Hall to explain why. Eric, what can you tell us about this? Well, hi there, Monica. Back in August 2021, Mayor Regina Romero and City Council voted to require all Tucson City employees get vaccinated for COVID. Now, the city granted hundreds of medical and religious exemptions. But in this lawsuit, Attorney General Brnovich says that the city discriminated against some employees who refused to get the shots. Tonight, City Councilman Steve Kazachik claims the lawsuit is bogus. The city tells News 4 Tucson it first learned of the lawsuit Tuesday afternoon in a news release from the Attorney General's office. Outgoing Arizona Attorney General Mark Brnovich claims the city discriminated against some of its employees based on religion or disability. But the city says it granted hundreds of religious and medical exemptions. City Councilman Steve Kazachik argues the city did the right thing last summer, and he says the law is on City Hall's side. For Brnovich to say that a, we don't have the right uh, to request exemptions, and B, calling it discriminatory for us to impose workplace restrictions on people who continued to remain unvaccinated is just foolish. Fighting yesterday's battle over vaccine mandates is just unbelievable to me that the guy's that small. The attorney general claims some employees who missed the first vaccine deadline faced an unpaid suspension for several days. He says most of those employees worked for Tucson police or Tucson fire. In a statement, Attorney General Brnovich says, quote, Tucson dictated a widespread vaccine mandate without regard to its impact on the liberties and civil rights of its employees. Many of those affected are first responders, and it's our turn to be there for them. The city's misguided vaccine mandate is an ugly example of government overreach that we must vigorously oppose. Brnovich lost the GOP primary for the U.S. Senate this month, and his time as attorney general is running out. He's term limited come January. Mark Brnovich simply needs a hobby. You know, the guy's virtually going to be out of work in the next couple of months. He has nothing better to do with his time. Get yourself a hobby and, and get out of our, our knickers. You know, this is we, we acted according to the law and he knows it. Now, now, city officials tell me that the lawsuit has yet to be served here to City Hall. The vaccine requirement remains in place with some exemptions for current and prospective city employees. We're live downtown at City Hall tonight. I'm Eric Fink, News 4 Tucson. Thank you for that, Eric. Well, tonight,